our very founding was based on innovation. We've always wanted to be, you know, 10 steps ahead of everybody else in our innovation. You know that from the second we finish the demolition for the last building, that was a really fun thing. We got in tractors and knocked walls down and stuff, and we've been plotting how can we knock down another building. And so today that came to fruition. It was a beautiful thing. Yeah. Big cloud of dust. This is just another step in that direction, having world-class facilities where we can uh, do things that nobody else can do. We wanted something that was really clean and sort of futuristic that represented the kind of innovation that we do as a company, which is, you know, ultra-modern, ahead of its time. And we wanted the building to feel that way. We were able to acquire the street in between the two blocks, which will allow us to build a beautiful atrium that will allow people to come and go from, the, from both sides of the, the building without having to go out in weather. But not only that, be within this beautiful environment where they can meet and eat and greet and uh, where we can hold events and so forth. It's going to be a, a, a wonderful uh, place for us to create community. I've been impressed that Truman has been insistent all along the way that whatever we do, that it be a landmark that we build here. It was a much bigger number than we hit it. <laughs> That's what surprised me about Truman. We found cheaper architects building cheaper buildings, but now he went for the most expensive one. That's the only odd question. All the rest of us loved it. Uh, but to have Truman say, yeah, let's go with the larger budget. <laughs> There's something fishy. <laughs> we wanted someone who had been involved in really cool projects like the Apple buildings. We've always liked the Apple computer buildings. We wanted people who could do that kind of look and feel that we thought matched nicely with who we are. It's our hope that when distributors bring their contacts around the company to kick the tires and so forth, that this innovation center will reinforce the vision that they've already projected about who the company is. And that is an innovative, forward-looking uh, company that's building into the future rather than relying upon its past. And it's just going to be a delightful place for everybody to uh, get creative.